All right, happy Friday. Today's topic, the zombie apocalypse, Facebook, selfies, and seeking the others. The first time I saw Night of the Living Dead, I was six years old, and ever since then, zombies have been my favorite nerd geek out topic. I have the original somewhere, but I can't find it, so here's the remake. One of the few instances where the remake might actually be better than the original. Tough call. It's hard to name your favorite movie of all time because there's so many of them, but this one is probably it for me. Dawn of the Dead, 1978. This is probably my favorite movie of all time. It's, it's way up there. And then... The sequel to that, Day of the Dead. A lot of people don't like this movie. I like it. The thing I like about the zombie apocalypse genre is what are people going to do? Like, how are people going to react to it? So this movie, like, covers that a lot. Not a lot of action in this movie, but it's more like the scenario. The scenario's a little bit stupid. They want to domesticate zombies. How are you going to domesticate a billion zombies? It's impossible. So, kind of a dumb plot, but... I like the characters a lot in this movie. And I like the whole, like, what are you going to do? Like, where are people going to go? So I enjoy that a lot. And then here's Resident Evil Biohazard in Japan. The original Resident Evil game. Uh, 1997. How old was I? 14? Was I 14 or 15 when that came out? So this is what made me think guns. So when I saw Night of the Living Dead... I was six years old, so I wasn't thinking guns. I was six. I was a toddler, so I was thinking, my parents don't have enough furniture. How? What are we going to do when the zombies come? Like, they're going to get in through the windows or the, you know, the door. We can't, we don't have anything to board it up. So I was thinking in my head when I was six, like, I got to run to my friend's house. They have a lot of furniture. So I wasn't thinking guns when I was younger, but... When I played Resident Evil, that's when I was thinking guns. And this was my vision as a teenager. I was thinking to myself, man, someday when we all grow up, me and my friends, when we all grow up, we're going to have cool guns. We're going to hang out, shoot guns. And if the zombie apocalypse happens, we'll be all right. Because one of the scenes in this movie, it's the rednecks just hanging out with their hunting rifles having a good time in the zombie apocalypse, and they're kicking ass because they all have guns. So I wanted to kind of be like that. I wanted to have guns too, and I wanted to have guns with my friends so we could all hang out, see what each other has, you know, but my life didn't end up that way. My friends aren't into guns. All they do all day, and this is no exaggeration, all they do all day is log on Facebook, cry about the election results, and take duck face selfies. So, yeah. Uh, me and my friends kind of grew apart. We don't have si similar interests anymore. I need to start seeking the others. The others. People who are a little different. They see life a little differently. They like to have fun. I like to have fun. And it's fun to think about nerd stuff like the zombie apocalypse. It's fun to shoot guns. But yeah, uh, I'm not into taking duck face selfies and going to the mall. I'm in my fucking 30s, for Christ's sake. Dudes in their 30s should not take duck face selfies. Maybe if you're like 15 and you're a guy, you should take duck face selfies. But even then, I don't think duck face selfies is a very masculine, guy-like thing to do. So, yeah, here's my... Here's my uh, zombie apocalypse stuff right here. Got to do the whole video game thing. So, yeah, I don't have any cool friends who, uh, you know, I could call up and say, hey, you want to head out to the desert this weekend, shoot some guns, blow up some zombie targets? I don't know anyone like that. So shout out to my friend Allegra. She's one of the few people that I've met I've met her on YouTube, and I actually got to meet her in real life. Unfortunately, she lives far away, but she's totally someone, like, if she lived close, I would call her up, say, hey, dude, want to head out to the desert, shoot some zombies, and then she has her own gun. So I like that. Like, I try to get my duck face selfie 
male friends into guns, but they're not into it at all. You know, if you've ever shot guns, you know what I'm talking about here. They had the chick lean stance. Now, I try to show them how to stand with the gun, but their bodies automatically reverted to the chick lean. That should have told me right there that they were special snowflakes. Once I showed them how to shoot, and I tried to like push their shoulder forward, and then once I let go of their shoulder, they automatically went to chick lean mode. So that right there, I should have known they were special snowflakes. So, you know, it kind of sucks, you know, because... Oh, and then another thing I like about the zombie genre, like, in this movie, Ben finds a hunting rifle. Hunting rifle? No, it was a lever action. That's not a hunting rifle. That's like just a cowboy gun. The original was a hunting rifle. But yeah, he finds a lever action rifle, and then he's like looking through the drawers, and then he finds a box of ammo. So I always wonder, like, if the zombie apocalypse happened, like... When you go through people's houses, you know, like, once people all start turning to zombies and then there's all these houses, like, if you open drawers, will you find anything? Where do people keep their ammo? So here's ammo right here. So, yeah, it's a, it's a fun topic, but... Oh, if the zombie apocalypse... That's what I... This is why I made this video. If the zombie apocalypse happened now, you know what would happen? People wouldn't... People wouldn't have guns. Only a few, only some of us would have guns and we would kick ass, but most people would be like this. They would be on Facebook and they would be on their, like, you know, laptop or their little uh, phone, their tablet, and they would be posting on their wall and they would be posting something like, OMG, zombies are here. And then they would take scared selfies, zombies at the door. And then they would take selfies by the door with their scared face. And then the zombies would get them because they're not, they're like talking about the zombie apocalypse on Facebook. They're not actually doing anything about it. So I, I need to seek the others. Like I'm a lone wolf, but I actually do like making new friends. Like I, I like some of my coworkers, but like my long time, 20 plus year friends, we, we grew apart, man. So I need to seek the others. Like my friend Allegra, I consider her the others, you know, I need to seek people like that, people who are fun, you know, you could, uh, geek out about stuff, see, I have no one to geek out with, I don't have any friends who geek out, I, how do you geek out over selfies, you don't, but, you know, like, zombie apocalypse geek out stuff, or just hanging out, like, doing something active, people are just, they just want to sit down all day and be on Facebook, like, I don't want to live my life like that, like, I like posting YouTube videos a lot, because I like talking to people through the comments, and I like sharing hobbies, and I like actually doing things. I think being on Facebook all day is such a waste of freaking life. All right, everyone. Zombie apocalypse, if it happened now, people would get smoked. They would get wrecked because they would be too busy taking selfies, you know, than actually doing something about it. All right, everyone. Have a great weekend.